So first of all, Maury, obviously disappointed for you. Like, you must be disappointed. Talk me through your feelings at the moment. Yeah, uh, just devastated. Um, I think everyone in the squad is. You know, we had that real belief again um, that we were going to at least, you know, take it a step further and go to Wembley. And it hasn't worked out for that, and everyone's uh, got to do it. And obviously, you said obviously the confidence was high in the squad. What what do you think happened there over the two legs, and, and what did Rotherham offer? Yeah, I think um, you know the home game was a bit. I don't think we played great. We conceded a couple of sloppy goals, but we kept ourselves in it. You know, we were showing real fight and determination to get ourselves back into it. And then I, th I thought we've, we've done okay today. Um, you know, they they made it hard for us to play, which they've done at home. Um, and we were trying to break them down. And, and, and one thing you mentioned there, obviously, especially in the first leg, there was that fight there. And throughout the season, we've seen the boys, you know, you've all come back from, from deficits and, and come on to win it. How proud have you been of the, the whole season so far? Yeah, you know, it's, it's easy to just look at this game and, and feel like we do, devastated everybody is. But you've got to look at the, the whole season, you know, the, the character of the boys, you know, doing really well and have gone through a bad, bad spell change manager and, and, and we've come you know come back strong and it's, it's just uh, obviously disappointing not to not to go even further. And talk to me about the squad obviously how much have you enjoyed playing with the boys this year? Yeah um, you know it was, it was such a good, good group of lads last year I, I, I didn't think we could uh, improve but you know the players, players that have come in have, have been brilliant um, you know the loan players new additions permanent signs and stuff like that I thought the squad's improved and um, it's just disappointing that, that we didn't improve on um, where we went last year. And one player obviously that stepped in today, really impressed, talked to me about Roy Watson's performance. Yeah, he's been brilliant. Um, you know, he's played a few games earlier in the season. I uh, thought he'd done well um, at a tough time for us. And he's, he is a good player. You know, he's some of the saves he's pulled off there. And brilliant saves. And he just, you know, he's had to be patient. Um, What a great chance to, to come in and play. Definitely, and looking forward to next season, how do you kind of pick yourselves up and dust yourselves off and, and get going for next season? Yeah, um, I guess, you know, when we come back pre season or off season, um, you've just got to say to yourself, I, I, I don't want to be in this position again, I don't, I don't want to leave it up to chance, I don't want to leave it down to playoffs or anything like that, but we've got to just work as hard as we can to, to try improve our league position and, and get over sleep. And there was obviously quite a lot of travelling supporters today, sold out the away allocation. Do you want to thank them for the season? Yeah, you know they've been very all season. Um, home and away. Um, you know, they've been very for us and felt over the two legs especially. They've turned up in the numbers which has been great for us. Uh, and so if, if, uh, not get further. And how much of an impact have they had throughout the season? How big have they been? Yeah, of course, you know, at the times when, when things have been really tough, you know, it would be easy for them to, to not come and, you know, um, but, but they have, and, and, you know, with their support, they've helped us turn it around. So. Thanks for your time, Laurie.